Hello guys, what's up? Harsh here from Android Solutions. And guys, today I'm going to show you how you can install the Cyanogen Mode 13 officially in your Redmi Note 3. So guys, first of all, you have to take care of few things that you need. A device with TWRP installed and with unlocked bootloader. If you guys want to know how to unlock the bootloader of this Redmi Note 3, you can check my channel for the video of unlocking the bootloader. And in that video, I have given the solution for that whose devices are stuck at 50% while unlocking the bootloader. So guys, let's get started. So guys, first of all, let me show you the device info. So as you can see, my MIUI version is 7.3.7 .7 with Android version 5.1.1. In this, I am going to install the Cyanogen Mode 13, which is based on Marshmallow. So first of all, power of the device. So guys, my device has powered off. Now to enter into TWRP recovery, you have to press the volume up button and power key both of them together until you see the MI logo on the screen now it will directly boot up into your TWRP recovery and guys make sure you have the latest TWRP 3.0.2.2 now first of all guys you need to place the CM13 ROM file and GApps file in your uh, external SD card uh, make sure not to place them in your internal storage because we have to wipe them during the process I have already downloaded and placed it in my external SD card I will put the required links in the description box below so no need to worry so guys here you can see Sanogen Mode 13 so first of all I need to wipe my phone select the first 5 options Guys, make sure after this process your internal storage will be totally wiped off. If you want to make the backup, you can make. Otherwise, just wipe the device. Now click on this swipe for factory reset. And it's over. Now we have to install the room. There is our Cyanogen mode 13. Click on it and swipe to confirm flash it will take only some time it's showing patching system image unconditionally verifying the updated system image and guys make sure that my android channel on, the, uh, on this youtube is for both devices for Redmi Note 3 and as well as for Samsung Galaxy S2 S2 I will not stop making on Samsung Galaxy S2 S2 but on Redmi Note 3 I will ma uh, make the regular videos in about 15 to 20 days so make sure to check it out now guys I have to reboot the system So guys you can see the Cyanogen mode logo. And this Cyanogen mode 13 is official, uh, officially ROM. That means this is not an unofficial version of Cyanogen mode 13. It is an official version of Cyanogen Mode 13. So you can you know well that it contains very less bugs. According to me, it has no bugs. Fingerprint sensors have all have also been added to this room. So as you can see, Android has starting optimizing the apps.
it will be over soon guys As you can see now it's around 91 plus, uh, 91 of 97 so it's now finishing its boot guys select the english india and click on next button if you want to add the Wi-Fi network you can add one or you can just skip it let me skip it for now skip it so as you can see here you can add the fingerprint setup click next firstly you have to select the backup method I will select pin now you can uh, select which uh, uh, what do you want to show when your device is locked now you have to locate now you have to touch on the sensors fingerprint sensor basically has been added now click on next you if you want to select you can select the time zone let me skip it for now now click on short so guys here you can see it's the standard mode 13 firstly let us jump up into the settings about phone as you can see guys it's android version is marshmallow with marshmallow fluffy words game so as you can see here that new settings have been added up for notifications storage usb etc now guys to install the google apps you need to install the gaps so again power of the device and again we have to boot up into a TWRP recovery now guys click on install button and go to the micro SD card and browse for the gaps location guys make sure that you have to download this open gaps arm 64 6.0 nano click on it and swipe it will be over soon it will not take much time and guys if you want to add in the uh, whatsapp group of android solutions uh, you can message me on my whatsapp number i will put my number in the description box below so make sure to check it out for the latest update on Redmi Note 3 now click on the boot system it will boot up normally it will optimize the google play services apps now it's finishing its boot so guys for more video on this redmi note 3 keep subscribing me and like the video if it's worked well for you thanks guys for watching up my videos